temporary light poles now line part of the Moakley Bridge in Boston. One of the bridge's original poles fell over last week, seriously injuring a 35-year-old woman on the sidewalk. We are so lucky uh, that that uh, pedestrian was not killed. After the accident, city crews immediately removed 23 other poles from the bridge. A state inspector's report received by the city back in August had given the poles a rating of 5 out of 9, but also flagged some of them for severe damage and in need of repair as soon as possible. If there's a report there that showed failing infrastructure. Whose desk was it on? Did you read it? If you read it, how come there isn't any action on it? The report came back as needing attention, but not in urgent emergency. Mayor Wu Have recently it. said the report was referred to a consultant, but no work was done until after the accident. I think we all know our city workers, and we know that they work hard on a daily basis, especially those who are out there in the elements. Some city councilors suggested Boston's weather and the proximity of the Salty Harbor might be factors in why the poles on the 26-year-old bridge rusted so much. And some said the city needs to do a better job of inspecting and replacing all infrastructure. We should be addressing these issues uh, on sort of a, on a methodical and regular uh, basis. The city council took no action today other than to refer this topic to a committee for further discussion. At last word, the victim was still recovering. Live in the Seaport, David Beating, WCVB News Center 5.